Weed control in soybeans is very important. It is crucial that farmers know the weed spectrum on their farm in order to apply the correct herbicides at the right time. With the introduction of glyphosate-resistant cultivars, the so-called Roundup Ready cultivars, farmers sometimes rely only on this herbicide to control weeds. But in cases where weeds are out of control, the soybeans would have been suffering for some time from competition for water and nutrients. This is an example of poor weed control in soybeans. Not only will the yield of soybeans be lower, but the harvesting process will also be difficult. The biggest weed problem nowadays is volunteer Roundup Ready maize in Roundup Ready soybean fields because Roundup will not control the maize. In cases like this, it is recommended that conventional herbicides are used that can control maize but not soybeans. Weeds that are difficult to control include grasses like Johnson grass and wild grain sorghum. This is an example of a field infested with wild sorghum. Morning glory is a problem weed because it emerges late in the season when control is difficult. Yellow and red nutsedge is also difficult to control because these emerge early in the season and therefore no till farmers cannot control them with conventional cultivation methods. Wandering Jew is a broadleaf weed that is difficult to control once it becomes established. Early control is therefore essential. Horseweed is a very hardy weed and since it emerges during the winter, it must be controlled before planting. Do not misuse Roundup Ready. These soybeans were spread with Roundup, but, as can be seen, they are suffering from competition with weeds that are too big. Timely control of weeds is very important. In this case, it is difficult to distinguish between weeds and soybeans. Damage to the soybeans is visible. One must never plant into weed, because from the time the soybeans emerge, they will be under stress and this will decrease yields. The correct way to control weeds in soybeans is to use a broad-spectrum herbicide before emergence of the crop, followed by only one, or in severe cases, two applications of Roundup Ready later in the season. Some Roundup Ready soybean cultivars are more sensitive to Roundup applications and when conditions are not good, such as on very hot days, damage to the leaves will be visible. Fortunately, this damage is temporary and will disappear within a week with no influence on the eventual yield.